Hi, I'm Garvin Lynch. Welcome to Lynch's Pharmacy Health Video Series. This video is on cough treatments. So cough medicines can be broadly divided into two. There are cough suppressants for a dry, tickly cough and mucolytics and expectorants for a chesty, productive cough. Most products are combination products. Anyway, containing one or more of these. For the cough suppressants, the main ones that you find for all the different products are dextromethorphan, codeine and falcodine. So the three of these make up most cough suppressants. They all work on the brain to suppress the cough reflex. They all have the potential to cause sedation. So just be aware of that. Benelin dry cough, non-drowsy. This is just pure dextromethorphan. Robitussin has pretty much an identical product, which is Robitussin dry cough. And again, it's just pure dextromethorphan. The other ones would be Codinex, would, which would be just pure codeine, and Falcodex, which is pure Falcodine. So Benelin dry cough can be used from 12 years of age and up. Some of the cough suppressants have antihistamines in them as well, which is great. They work very well if you have a cold with a head cold because it will dry up any nasal secretions. And it's very good for clearing up a runny nose in a kid as well. However, anything with an antihistamine in it can cause drowsiness and very often does. So the main antihistamines used are tryptamidine, promethazine and diphenhydramine. So they can all cause drowsiness. Benelin children's coughs and colds can be used from the age of six years of age and up. And it's a fantastic product. It's very good to give to a child, which will help them sleep as well and clear up any head cold, runny nose type symptoms. Benelin children's dry cough again can be used from six years of age and up. The original Benelin cough medicine is the same as Benelin children's dry cough expectorant, except double the dose. So it contains diphenhydramine and levomenthol, but twice as much as what's in Benelin dry cough. Benelin dual action dry syrup can be used again from the age of six years of age and upwards. It contains tryptamidine, again an antihistamine, and it also contains a decongestant called pseudoephedrine. Now with pseudoephedrine and any other decongestant, there are some extra precautions you have to take when or before you take them. Congestion is caused by inflammation of the blood vessels in the nose. So what decongestants like pseudoephedrine do is constrict those vessels and shrink them back down to their normal size, which is great for relieving congestion, but this can have an effect on blood pressure. Therefore, any product, any type of product with pseudoephedrine is used, such as in a cough medicine or an oral decongestant, you'd need to tell a pharmacist this before you buy it if you are on blood pressure medication and you should avoid the product. The pharmacist will recommend something else. So this goes for any product that contains pseudoephedrine or similar decongestants. There are other products besides the cough suppressant bottles that can be used for a dry cough called demulsants, which work by lining or coating the respiratory tract and soothing any irritation. A typical example would be glycerine, honey and lemon, which can be used at the age of one years of age and up. For a chesty productive cough, we have expectorants and mucolytics. The main expectorant used in chesty cough medicine is guafenicin. It's found in most of the Benelin products. The way it, in which expectorants work basically is they increase the amount of fluid secreted into the respiratory tract and make the mucus much thinner and much easier to break off and cough up. Benelin non-drowsy can be used from the age of 12 years of age and up. It contains guafenicin. And then there's a children's version which can be used from six years of age and up, which is Benelin Children's Chesty Cough. And again, it, this contains guafenicin as well. Benelin Dual Action Chesty Syrup contains guafenicin and also contains pseudoephedrine. So the same rules apply regarding anyone being on blood pressure medication. It can be used from six years of age and up. 
Viscolex and Exutex both contain cannabocysteine, which is a mucolytic. It breaks up the mucus and makes it easier to cough up. So always tell a pharmacist or a doctor your history if you've any stomach ulcers or stomach problems because of the way these medicines work. They break up the mucus and it almost dissolves the mucus. It can have some of the same effect on the mucus that lines the inside of the stomach so that you don't want to be affected in someone who has had a stomach ulcer before. Similar products are Pulmocles and Casacol. They both contain mucolytics as well, and the same rules apply to them. They can be used from the age of six years of age and up, except for Pulmocles. But there is a Pulmocles paediatric product, which is for the six years of age. So these are some of the products available for treating a cough. It is debatable really how effective they are. There's a, still some controversy uh, over using them. If somebody presents to a pharmacy with a dry cough or a chesty cough and there should be a cough bottle in place to treat it, a cough with no serious cause will just resolve itself in a couple of days. But if a cough is persistent for more than two weeks, then you need to go to see your GP. Now, if you have any questions, you can contact me through the live pharmacist, you can email me or you can call into the pharmacy in Broaddale and Douglas. Thank you for watching.